and can drink on the job. <laughs> so that means that, you know, whenever, like, number one, when you call, call home after work, it's a little bit different. Like, my husband's like, nope, don't call here right now. <laughs> but also, like, when I'm at home, my, my phone will start kind of going off, you know, in the middle of the night, and I have to roll over and go, my friends are just getting off work. <laughs> They're just sitting the fuck away, you know? And, uh, yeah, it's, I'm like, they're just checking on me to see if I'm gigging too, like, they're bored on the bus or whatever, you want to talk. So, uh, I told, I told Roy one time, I was like, I know, it's always after midnight, I'm sorry. <laughs> and then I thought, hey, that's a really cool song title. <laughs> <laughs> and I kept it, and I, and I, uh, I had this chorus all lined out, and then the first thing that got canceled on me for the pandemic was a trip to Boston to go ride with Lori McKenna for three days. That was a hard one. All the gigs that got canceled, like, Gigs come and gigs go, but like the chance to go to stay at Lori McKenna's and write for three days doesn't come around. So that I had to cancel. And then we were like, hey, but you know what? We could still like maybe FaceTime. So I went to this hunting lodge in Hondo, Texas, and borrowed their Wi Fi so I wasn't in my house. <laughs> and I sat on the floor of the hunting lodge and FaceTimed Lori McKenna and said, well, I have this chorus. So this is what we wrote that in. Some people can't see straight in the light. So they say their decisions for the dark and the night. Some people need a couple of drinks to help them.
Wondering if you'll call. Wondering if you'll call. 